what's there? I'll not let a single moron escape! my opponent should be. Yeah. 
It's boring. Her mother died. Etna's. 
the star-crossed tragic beauties, misfortune began. To get a slice of his humongous fortune pie, women hungrily tried to seduce her father. She wound up with a wicked stepmother and conniving stepsisters. Due to their constant belittling, at a lot until... Are you stupid or something? Why would I let you do something even remotely important? I was just trying to add a little variation to the previews. For example, one where I seem unmotivated. Another when I want to appear sentimental. Because like you guys said, this is my only real defining character trait. Right? Yeah! She's still not over that, dude! Never escape from death! Give me a break, dude! Morning. I'm going to become an overlord in my dreams. When do you want in? How it make? I need to relieve Please, my tension come. first. Today's dinner, cream of carrot soup. I made it all by myself. There's a healthy carrot salad, too. Dig in. Miss Violet, your cooking is fantastic. I can taste the love you put into it. Really? Thank you. Please eat as much as you want. I'm sick of carrots. When are you going to get over this unhealthy obsession? At least they're tasty. What other choice is there? Oh, I know. Here's my special salad dressing. I'll let you use it just this once. No, you won't sucker me again. Your dressing is flavored with the evil and murderous intents of your wicked heart. What's your problem? You'll use it, won't you, Theo? No, thanks. I've already opened the regular one. Claude, how about you? Homemade dressing? Can I sample your culinary love, too? Please! The more you use, the yummier it'll get! Buds took the short bus to sensory school. That's horrible. They're as normal as all of your taste buds. Taste is subjective. I guess it's all okay if she enjoys it by herself. Theo, your leniency towards this harlot will be your downfall. Sometimes, you must crack the whip. Ah, uh, could it be she's learned a sensitive secret about you? Then... Lucius... 
If you don't stop imagining stupid things, I'll squirt my dressing into all of your orifices as you sleep. Disgusting, Roselia! I'd definitely die! Fine, fine. Wait, what was that? It came from way up above, I think. Look! Another floating ruin has fallen into orbit! That sound... no, that voice... impossible. That was close! If that had struck Imperia City, it'd be a colossal disaster! Yeah, we should go do something about this. Freaks keep the peace? Why can't I escape this carnival of pain? Roselia, is everything okay? Hmm? Why do you ask, Theo? I just thought you'd been gloomy since we fought those dragons. Not true at all. Haven't you seen my energetic smile? That's reassuring. But if you're in some kind of trouble, just tell me. I'm always here to help. I will. Thank you. Miss Rosalia! Let's go! If we're doing this, let's make it snappy. I'm coming! Theo, you come too. Of course. Let's do our best. Young Kanata longs for an adventure. Mm. Yeah! You're really throwing me, dude! It's just so much fun. How was that, Tsubaki? My episode preview wasn't that bad, was it? It was definitely triple-A material. Is she ever honest? Maybe, like, two out of five comments or something? monster carries such a strong aura. It seems way more formidable than I imagined. Never fear! When we gather all our powers of love together, our opponent will grow powerless! Love? Together? There she goes again. Sir Lucius, surely you realize the feelings of love and friendship inside you. Or have you not noticed? Inside you lies dormant the feelings of love for your family, friends, your special someone. I have no such things. But aren't you a hero? I'm no milk toast protagonist. I am the dark hero. As we live our lives, it is inevitable we make a mistake or two. You can't avoid that. But, if you go astray, it's always possible to get back on the right track. Sir Lucius, why not fight your shadow and become the hero of light? You could even use healing magic. Don't worry, myself, Miss Roselia, and Miss Violet will join you as well. Let's get Sir Lucius onto the proper story arc with our love. No, that's been done before. I'll do what I want. Let's just... Go defeat that monster. You can't stay this shy forever. Uh, I think he 
he's seriously angry. for me. I'm hungry. I'd love to eat a big steak. in the blade. So, it really is the same. It? I wielded this sword long ago, before I fell, when I was just a stereotypical hero. Why did you abandon it here? Lucius, I want you to talk to us about it. Back then, I had just succeeded my late father's title. No flashbacks, please. Keep it short. No, Miss Rosalia. It's not courteous to rush a character's backstory. Let him talk for once. My services were requested from a small rural town to chase off the monsters eating their crops. I accepted. I thought it sounded like those easy quests at the beginning of games. But I failed to slay them all. Afterwards, the monster I let get away ran into my client's town. Due to losing its comrades, it went on a rampage and took many lives of its own. Eventually, I chased it away. Because of my failure, my title of hero was revoked, and my family was labeled a group of failures. Since then, my family lost everything. That one mistake destroyed our entire estate. Then I realized a hero without power is nothing. This was the sword I used to chase the monster from the city. I stabbed this deep into its back. Lucius, I had no idea you had such a past. I wouldn't have imagined you'd become the dark hero for such a serious reason. I'm a bit surprised too. I just figured your sense of what was cool was a bit off or something. Is that what you thought of me? I have a tragic past just like all of you! So, the one that got away is around here now? This place doesn't look peaceful in the least. I wouldn't be surprised if it's nearby. If so, I must kill it once and for all. I'll let nobody else do it. Lucius, please let us help. We can find and defeat it together. 
Yeah, if we defeat it here, it won't harm anyone else ever again. This is none of your concern. This is my problem. Stop being such a stubborn brat. I don't care about what you want. I'm helping anyway. Roselia, don't say it like that. He doesn't mean to be that way. I'll fight the monster by your side, no matter what you say to stop me. Uh, do what you like. I don't give a damn about what you do. fight. I agree with Theo. We should let Lucius deliver the final blow, otherwise it's pointless. Let's watch him fight and trust in his power. Yeah, I know he can do it. If he gets into a pinch, we can always save him. Uh, this would be more effective for my ego if I couldn't hear you planning to aid me. Are they just teasing me, or am I imagining things? Even my strength. That's it? That was so good! That's it, right? 